aliens have arrived in Animal Revolt's Battle Simulator. So we've got these new units. We've got this new landscape. And of course, the skybox. But for now, let's stick with the nice, bright blue sky. So let's start with Buzzhook. This thing looks absolutely terrifying. Look at the claws. Is, is that his mouth? Or is that his mouth over there? I have no idea. Either way, we're going to check out all of the new units. And also, I'm going to reveal my favorite at the end because, um, well, I haven't actually seen any of them in action yet. You know what? Let's just make the units fight a tiger to begin with and see what they can do. So, of course, this one flies right here. Oh, my goodness. It can pick up units. Oh, that is so cool. That makes it so powerful. So, if a unit is, of course, not too heavy, it can pick it up. Wait, actually, how heavy can it go? Surely it can't pick up a rhino, right? What? <laughs> How is that even possible? This is such a powerful unit and it's not even that expensive. It's the first one on the list. Look at that. The rhino's down right away. Wait, is it down? No, it's still alive. Oh, that noise. I can't believe we actually have aliens in arbs now. I know there were mods in the past, but now there's actual units in the game. Why is it flying away? Oh, here we go. There we go. And just like that, the rhino is down. I should also mention I will, of course, be experimenting with the units, making them, uh, you know, crazy sizes and stuff. I don't know. Maybe that will actually help them lift heavier objects. Also, feel free to let me know your favorite unit in the comment section down below. We got to test this. Let's see. Can it pick up a T-Rex? There is no way, right? Oh, okay. Yep. Um, I... I just had to try, okay? Ooh, they got like brown, yellowy blood. Nice. So let's move on to the next unit. We've got here Vontis. Hopefully that's how you pronounce it. Okay, let's see what it does to the tiger. I mean, the tiger is a pretty easy unit for them to take down, but I think it gives us a good idea of their attacks and what exactly they can do. And just like that, the tiger is down. Okay, alien versus elephant. Whoa, it's jumped up on its head. And now it's stabbing it with its claws. Oh, hang on, look at that attack as well. Oh, we did not see that before. It's poisoned the elephant. What is on its skin? It didn't do that. If it used that attack on the tiger, I reckon the tiger would have lost a lot quicker. Maybe the target needs to be bigger to be injected. So can the Vontis take down a T-Rex? Surely if it injects it, right? It might just be able to. Although... Um, it's not looking too good right now because it can't get a clean shot. It just keeps getting eaten. Uh, yeah. Okay, it didn't work out. But picture this. The T-Rex is unaware of the alien behind it. Now, let's see what happens, shall we? Come on, inject it. Oh, did it work? Oh, no, he's been discovered. Oh, no. Um, okay. Yep, it didn't work out. Oh, we did infect him, though. He just didn't die. Ooh, quite a bit of damage, though. But let's move on to the next one. So this right here is Hacklaw. Let's take a closer look. So it's got long claws at the bottom there. It looks like it's got some armor, potentially. A terrifying mouth and these giant tentacle claw things. Anyway, we're going in for the tiger test once again. Oh, okay. It's using the claws. That's good to see. This unit is a little bit on the small side, so it is struggling a little bit. It's eating his ankles. <laughs> oh, no. The tiger is just going around in circles. Okay, but... Oh, I definitely think we're going to win this one. Yes, look at that. Whoa, what the? That was brutal. Tiger is down. All right, so let's go for a unit more like its size, such as King Kong right here. Surely the alien isn't going to lose to King Kong, right? Seems pretty powerful. It's got a lot of claws, but who knows? Whoa, that attack is actually so brutal when that happens. Wow, dead straight away after that one. So next up, we've got here the Xenoverb. I'm hoping I'm pronouncing that right, but... It looks like alien eggs. Oh, are they hatching? I think they are. Whoa, what happened? Oh, they did hatch. What are these things? Little bug looking things. Oh, oh, they're eating the tiger alive. That is crazy. And the tiger is down. Oh, these things have got to be really powerful. You know what? Since there's six of them, I reckon they can take on a Spinosaurus. I hope. Oh, no, one's been eaten, but it's all right. It's a sacrifice so the others can start eating its flesh. So once they get latched onto the back of the dinosaur, well, the dinosaur is going to struggle to actually eat them just like that. So I think there's so far three down. Oh, no, there's only one remaining. Oh, no. No, 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 no. This is bad. I don't know what I was thinking. The Spinosaurus is, of course, more powerful than these little alien bugs. But with that being said, they got pretty close to taking it down. But something tells me this time they're going to win. Oh, <laughs> there's literally hundreds. Look at them go. There's so many of them. <laughs> oh, the Spinosaurus does not stand a chance. 
look at them all and it is down just like that we didn't even need all of those bugs now i think this is the unit i am most excited for it is the most expensive and the largest it is ranthorn so i'll be honest doing the tiger test with this guy right here doesn't make a lot of sense but since we've done it with all the other units we're just gonna do it anyway all right here we go how quickly will he win oh he's gone for his legs here we go oh one punch was that it is it dead oh it's so close to dying that could have easily been a one punch oh it's now it's dead okay so this has got to be the most powerful unit in the update i would imagine since it's the most expensive it's the largest probably has the most health and so on what the what did king kong just do <laughs> just dived right into it so we've definitely got to try and take on goru the giant because that was super easy is he got a he's got a little face in there look at that now funnily enough this is of course an update video me checking out the new update but i never actually saw what came out in the last one which was a new Goru the Giant skin. So this is what it looks like. Let's see who wins. So this is basically Goru versus the new alien. Um, Goru is a lot more expensive. So he probably will end up winning. But I want to see just how much buy. So far, so good. Oh, mega punches. Oh, it's not looking too good. Right, let's actually watch the health, shall we? So right now, it's looking pretty equal, to be honest. Are they equally matched? I think Goru might just have the upper hand just by a little bit, but there are many punches being flung right now. Um, the alien does have fawns coming out of his arms, though, so that might give it a little bit of an advantage. Oh, no, the alien's going to lose. It's lost. Goru the giant is still an absolute beast. Now, I've made sure that Ranfawn won't lose the next fight because I've gone ahead and slightly upgraded him. Here we go. <laughs> I even gave it a tail too. So pretty basic Animal Revolt Bow Simulator upgrades. Um, yeah, I also made him a lot larger, as you can tell. So he's an absolute unit. Goru the Giant is about to get messed up big time. <laughs> I'm surprised the fight's actually gone on for this long. You know, I gave this guy quite a lot of upgrades, to be fair. I increased his stats, not by a crazy amount. Oh, there we go. Yes, victory. Barely any damage done to us. Now imagine this, the aliens attacking your base. So let's see if I can actually defend this place with my weapons right here. Also, we got my custom unit, as you can tell, doing the rounds right now. So I am mostly worried about that guy getting into the base. Um, I also have a limited amount of ammo, so I've got to be careful. Oh, look, a little bug thing. Let's take it down. Come on. I've just realized... The big alien is taking down every other unit. Maybe it's on our side. Yes, my custom unit is here to save us. Nobody shoot it, okay? It's on our side, right? Oh, it's it's dead. We won! Victory! You know what? Let's try this again, but the army is a lot larger, so I might need to hide in this house. Oh, no. Whoa, soldiers, heads up. Um, I think they might all be dead. We are absolutely surrounded right now. Um, not looking too good for us, I'll be honest. Die. Get out of here, aliens. The fence doesn't look like it's going to hold up for much longer. I've left the base. I'm going to sneak around and try and take some of them down. This might be a really stupid idea. Here we go. Yeah, that doesn't make any difference. But hey, at least I'm drawing them away from the base. I'm saving everyone. Yes. Oh, that's a landmine. Woo. Quick, get on the rock. Oh, no. Can they get up here? Please. Landmine, save me. He didn't do anything. Oh, no. There's so many of them. No. I don't know where else I'm going to go. Oh, there's another landmine. If I can draw them over here, I might be able to blow up one of them. Oh, no. I fell. No, no, no. Oh, okay. I I'm on the rock. I'm on the rock. This is good. Oh, here we go. Oh, I blew myself up. No. Oh, no. <laughs> They're going to get into the base. Now it's time for the alien exotica units to fight the carnivorous dinosaurs. And I have, of course, scaled this guy up all the way up to four. Uh, we have a bunch of aliens scaled up and even reduced in size as well. So it'll be interesting to see if that changes anything. But yeah, it makes the dinosaurs look really, really small, to be honest. But the dinosaurs are doing a pretty good job right now. I haven't changed the stats of anything other than the scale of the alien team. So it'll be interesting to see if the buzz hook can actually lift up the dinosaurs. Is that what they're called? Buzz hooks? Hook buzz? I can't remember, but these things right here. Oh, look out, T-Rex. Come on, can it pick any of them up? Uh, it looks like it's struggling right now. Yeah, I'm really, I'm really not too sure. Oh no, the big dude's going. He's gone, he's been pushed off the map. Wow, I think the carnivorous dinosaurs might actually win this fight, which is actually pretty safe. They did. 
but he ended up winning. That is incredible. But you know what? I might do a suggestions video for the new units. So you know what? Leave your best suggestions in the comment section down below. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.